Hello, hello, good afternoon. Hola, Jose. Bienvenido, hello. Jose. Gracias. Let's see, vamos a ver. We are going to wait some minutes more. The others can connect it, right? With the purpose of the mm. others being connected, we can start with, start with the class. Okay, just okay. we are going to give them three minutes more and then we're going to start, okay? Okay. Hello. Hello, hello, ¿cómo estamos, Maximiliano? Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, teacher. No lo escucho. Do you have some problems with your audio? Maybe. How about now? How about now? More or less. <laughs> Hello, Roberto. Good afternoon. Bienvenidos. Good afternoon. Thanks. You're welcome. Bye, chicos. Este día, pues, tenemos la penúltima sesión, chicos. Vamos a reunirnos el día mañana también, ¿verdad? Si find a mistake. Yes. Okay, perfect. So, the last time we were uh, given a homework, right? where wow. you are going to present two minutes of presentations about whatever you want to talk. Maybe a topic that it is considered for you interesting topic and that can help you to uh, motivate you, right? More to speak in English. You have to speak for two minutes, but if you want, we can let it for tomorrow, okay? Are you agree? Yes, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> So you didn't have enough time to make the homework, so I understand that. And I'm going to give you one day more, <laughs> okay? Yeah. Today we are going to talk about a new topic. Let me tell you guys. Today we are going to talk about how to use wood light, okay? Wood or wood light. Pero vamos, a, bueno, son las tres y seis minutos. It's six minutes past three. So that means we have to start. But we are just four guys. But it depends, right? Maybe the others can connect to later, right? So we are going to start with the class. Just give me some minutes. I'm going to open the note. No. The one nut, right? Where we are, guys. By the way, ¿cómo me les fue una semana, chicos? A ver, tell me something. Ah. Uh, it was a hard week. Yes, you're right. It's a hot week and a hard also, right? Because there are a yes. lot of other work. 
maybe because it's almost the end of the year. Yes, I think maybe, so. Maybe, maybe, right? <laughs> okay, so look at this, guys. Today is October Tuesday, 3rd, 2023. And our topic for today is how to use World Life. What would you like to eat? Okay, let's let's ask some questions. Okay, let's discuss. What would you like to eat today in the in at night? What would you like to eat at night? ¿Qué les gustaría I, comer en la noche? I would like to eat some fried chicken. I think. You would like to eat some fried chicken. Okay, excellent. Or what would you like to do? ¿Qué les gustaría hacer? Besides eat fried chicken, right? I don't know, teacher. I'm thinking maybe go, go out to dance with your friends or maybe have fun or maybe uh, sleep more, right? Maybe. Don't work. <laughs> Don't work now. Maybe there are some options, right? Think about it. What would you like to do, eh? Um, maybe I would like to see a movie. Okay, I would like to see a movie. Okay, perfect, excellent. Roberto, what would you like to do? Robert, I can hear you. You have problems with your audio. You have to connect your microphone. I would like to um, mix uh, with my coffee. Ah, you would like to drink some coffee? Yes. Okay, perfect. And you, Jose, what would you like to do today at night? Jose Alexander? I would like uh, X. Uh -huh. X. <laughs> but you would like to eat, but what? What would you like to eat? Uh, yes. ¿Qué le gustaría comer? Uh, X que guay frijol. Okay, <laughs> beans. Beans uh, also. Uh -huh. oh, I would like to eat pizza. Oh, I would like to eat soap. I would like to eat a fried chicken. Or I would like to eat meat. Maybe some things, right? Okay. Um, and that's a typical. <laughs> a typical food, right? Ah, typical, food. typical food. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Yeah. And you, Ramon, what would you like to eat today at night? Um, I would like to eat uh, some fried eggs. Uh -huh, fried um, eggs. Some beans with bread. I don't uh -huh. know. Excellent. Mm. Okay. It sounds good, right? Thank okay. you so much. Okay. Vamos a ver, Carlos Enriquez. Enrique, perdón. What would you like to eat? At night. Charlie? Carlos? Are you there? Hi, teacher. Hello, Carlos. What would you like to eat at night? Mm, I have a feeling I can find Max at Buffalo Wings because uh, I, mm, I like chunks and... Fried, fried chicken. Okay, perfect. So you would like to go to Buffalo Wings and eat some fried chicken, right? Okay, yes. excellent. It's a good option, right? That's taste, right? Those are tastes. Taste, I think son gustos, right? Okay, perfect. Good. And it's not bien. It sounds good, right? <laughs> also, I got to take it to account, right? For the next time. Okay, so... 
Let's start. What I made these questions because these questions is part of the structure that we are going to see right now, right? In this case, it says we use would like or would like to say polite what we want, especially when making offer or request. Quiere decir que would like es la forma educada de decir I want, que significa yo quiero, right? Entonces el significado sería me gustaría o quisiera, ¿verdad? Tal y tal cosa, pero no la forma educada, ¿ok? So, let's see some examples. Would you like a biscuit with your coffee? ¿Le gustaría un biscuit with your with coffee? Yes, yes, maybe. yes, maybe right now, right? Also a donut, right? Can you order for Ellie? Can you order for Ellie? She will like the marga margarita pizza, please, okay? This is the contraction, so would, okay? When you see these contractions, that means that it's she would like, okay? Would, this is the apostrophe with the D. Okay, should is a pronunciation. Should repeat. Should should like the margarita, like margarita pizza. Margarita pizza. Okay, perfect. So you are going to identify. Also, you are going to take into account the context that we are touching, right? And then, if you see these contractions, that means it is she would like. Okay, porque también el had también tiene una contracción similar. Pero este, este, usted va a identificarlo según lo que estemos hablando, ¿verdad? según el contexto. ¿Ok? Would you like to listen to that again? Would you like to listen to that again? ¿Te gustaría escuchar eso de nuevo? Yes, I would. Or no, I wouldn't. Could be positive, could be negative, right? This is just a review of what you were saying before, guys. I guess that you already managed this topic, right? a little bit right or completely it depends right but for for some occasions we have to remember that but we have to refresh that knowledge okay number four i like to get the return ticket for tomorrow okay i like to get the return ticket for tomorrow so this is the aberration of contraction again right that i would like okay so let's see the structure, guys. This is going to be the structure for a question. Remember that positive subject would like to plus where plus B form. This is talking about positive form, okay? Subject, we have a subject that is I, right? Would, in this case, is contracted, right? Or we have the aberration, or you have completely. It depends on you, right? If you want to use the contractions or if you want to use the complete phrase, right? Okay. Plus two plus a very impatient. And we have some examples. We have, I like a slice of cake, please. I like a slice of cake, please. No usaría una rebanada de pastel, por favor, right? I would like... Or I like to go on vacation. So would you like to go on vacation? Yes, I would like, right? Or I would, if you want to answer that point, that point, you can do it. Or I wouldn't. I don't believe that you wouldn't, right? But in case, just in case. <laughs> okay, so this is the positive form. So we have the negative form. The negative, negative form is constructed by the subject plus would plus the word not. That in this case, you can make the contraction that is wouldn't, okay? Plus, uh, okay, wouldn't, like, plus two, plus the verb in base forms. And some examples are explained here. She wouldn't like to expensive that. She wouldn't like an expensive that. A ella no le gustaría una cartera muy... Muy costosa, right? You wouldn't like to make him angry. You wouldn't like to make him angry. Okay, so we have a object pronoun here that we were saying that before, right? And also we have the contractions that is in negative form. A ti no te gustaría hacerlo enojar. Maybe 
the boy is a little angry and he tends to be like dangerous, right? When you get angry with them, <laughs> with him, right? Okay, so you wouldn't like to make him angry, right? And also, as you already know, we have three forms. We have the question form. We have will plus subject plus like plus num to, right? Plus the verb in base forms. For example, we have, would you like an apple? Would you like an apple, guys, right now? Yes, I would like. Yes, right? I would like. Yes, yes also, I would like. Ya no he visto a Maximiliano comer jocotes. <laughs> ya no me he visto los jocotes. <laughs> Son bromas. Yeah. I'm just kidding. Also, we have, would you like to go swimming next week? Yes, right? No? Or would you like to go, okay. Would you like to go to uh, drink something next week? You can say when you are going maybe. to buy a friend of you, right? Or maybe you are going to buy your girlfriend or maybe you are going to invite your your husband or your uh, wife, right? You can use that question. Would you like to go to swim? Would you like to go to drink something next week? Okay. So questions after here, guys? No. No? Okay, perfect. So if you want, you can take a picture and you can share it to the WhatsApp group. In order that you already can have it as a... Um, as a, remember that you have to take some notes, right? Me avisa cuando tomen la picture, please. All I stream. Listo. Excellent. Thank you so much for sharing. So let's continue, guys. So this is the ones that I told you. Would do you like to drink some coffee? I would like to drink water or coffee with milk. I like to drink blah, 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 blah. This is an example. This, this is the questions and this is the possible answer, right? I would like to drink water or maybe you, you don't want to drink water. You want to drink coffee with milk, right? Or maybe you can use the contractions or the abbreviation that is I like to drink some coffee with milk, or I like to drink some water, okay? It's it. Okay, so let's do a practice online, okay? Just give me some minutes and I'm going to open this. And I'm going to open the WhatsApp group and I'm going to share it there, okay? By the way, do you have some questions about that? No, it's all good for me. Okay, perfect. Nice, nice, guys. Ahorita es compacto. Solo, just give me some minutes, please. Okay, perfect. Let's spray. Mm -hmm. We are good. B, right? Okay, perfect. So, is there, okay? If, please, I get in the link. Um, I'm going to share what you're going to find out. Vaya, miren, chicos, estamos acá, um, Estamos acá, okay? What we were going to do, what would you like? And here you have some options, right? Task one, read the items in each line, click the one that doesn't below. Quiere decir que usted acá, me va a elegir el que no pertenece a lo que está dicho acá. Por ejemplo, acá tenemos so sopa, ¿verdad? ¿Qué es lo que contiene la sopa? Vegetables, chicken. Vegetables, chickens, and? Onion. Onion. And what doesn't belong to a soul? An omelette. An omelette. So you are going to choose the one that does not belong. Okay? Don't be confused. 
In the task oh. number two, we are going to read the dialogue and fill in the blanks with the appropriate word. So are you, you are going to decide what you are going to write there, okay? Almost over here. Customer, yes, please. I. Y usted va a decidir, ¿verdad? ¿Qué es lo que va a poner ahí? Luego va a leer y va a ir llenando, 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 ¿ok? Ok. Perfect. Vamos a ver. I will have please. Mm -hmm. bueno, número tres, dice, read the descriptions and scramble the words. Aquí me va a reordenar la palabra, ¿verdad? Pero primero me va a leer la oración, que, que es lo que es la pista, ¿verdad? This tells you that what food you can buy in a restaurant. And you are going to reorder the words here. And now task number four, you are going to listen this and you are going to write the words that you hear in this. Okay? Okay. Go, go ahead.
Let me know when you finish. I'm done. Teacher, give me a minute because it's raining in my house. <laughs> the clothes is outside. Okay, go around. Go there. <laughs> no worries. Vaya, vaya. <laughs> okay, Maximiliano. Okay, excellent. Eight of ten. Congratulations. No worries for that. Okay. Okay. Remember that the contractions is the D with the apostrophe, Maximiliano. So that means we're already there, the wood. Okay, vamos a ver, let's see. So we are going to wait for the others. Okay. Probar, okay. if you want. Make it again, no worries. No, it's <laughs> okay. I have um, a question. Uh huh. With the last part, I don't understand the number seven. Number seven. Just let me check. Part number one or part number two? Part number four. Four. Okay, let me see. The listening. The listening, right? Yes.
It says lemonade. Ah, okay. Lemonade. That it is. The eight. Como? The ocho. Number eight. Okay, let me say. Let me check. Hola. If you want, we can do it together, guys. Maybe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Let me check it. Number eight is cola. <laughs> Let me check where is that cola? Como Coca Cola. You get it? Number one, onion rings. Number two, vegetable. Para que, lo, para que los demás try, right? Well, the other ones can try, and then we're going to check it. Because just Maximiliano have done this, right? So it's just fun. One second. Okay, perfect, no worries. Me saca de la reunión, así de mole. Vaya, ok, perfecto. Bueno, well, ¿somebody else finish? Ok, los, ellos también están haciéndolo. ¿Qué me gusta trabajando en él? ¿Qué ve, Robert? ¿Cómo va usted, Robert? No te interesan de part 2, task 2. Okay. Um, the conversation, waiter, customer. Ah, yeah. 
which you have to complete the conversation. Okay, so you give up? No? Yes or no? <laughs> or would you like to try? <laughs> I have nine of ten in my second. Okay, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, vamos a ver. Let's see. Dice uh, Merino. It's seven of ten. Okay. Congratulations. You try. Who is me? Ah, okay. Edwin, Antonio. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I guess the second part is the most difficult, right? Okay, let's do it. The listening too. The listening, really? No, I don't believe you, Maximiliano. The listening, I guess it is easier. Ah, uh, this is very hard, teacher. <laughs> okay, perfect. So let's do it. Okay, this is it. task one. Read the items in each line. Click the one that doesn't belong. So you're going to choose which which is the first one: baseball, omelette, chicken, or onions. We say omelette, omelette, right? Oh. Because omelette doesn't belong to a soap. No, no pertenece a una sopa, okay? Entonces quiere decir que? Night of time, okay? Excellent, Maximiliano. Almost a ten, almost. But you do it, okay? So let it, okay, number two, sandwiches. What contain a sandwiches? The sandwiches contain eggs, cheese, and ham. But cake? Doesn't belong to sandwiches. Ice cream. We have banana, strawberry, or lemon, but burger doesn't belong to that also. Fruits use pineapple, mango, and orange, but cream doesn't belong to fruit juice, right? Number five, hot drinks. What are hot drinks? Coffee, chocolate, tea, right? But cola is not a hot drink. It's a cold drink. So it's the contrary, that's the, the things that you have to do. You have to choose what doesn't belong to that. Okay, let's see the second part. Are you ready, right, to order right. number two? Yes, please, I'd... I like, I like... I like pizza, please, with ham and mushrooms. Okay, do you... Want. Do you want... Do you want any chips with that? No, thank you. But can I have a green salad, please? Of course. Anything to drink? Yes, I'll have an apple juice, please. And what about? about. What about a dessert? Okay, how much? How much is the ice cream? It's three and fifty dollars, right? In this case, it's euros, right? Okay, a chocolate chocolate ice cream, please. Buy it. Ahora vamos con la siguiente. Vamos con la parte número tres. It's a read the description and scramble the words. The first one says, "This tell you that what food can you buy in a restaurant? What's the word?" Menu. Menu, okay. The second one. If you order soap, it will come on this. Bowl. Bowl. Bowl, okay. This is a bowl. Bowl, okay. Ahora vamos con la siguiente. Dice, this is a right, right? Bowl. This is the person who brings you food to you. Waiter. 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 Okay. A waiter. Okay, let's continue. A main so a main course usually includes some of this. Vegetables. Vegetables. Vegetables, right? 
You pay this before you leave a restaurant. Bill. Bill, right? Okay, bill. Next, you can book this at some restaurant. Table. Table. Okay, excellent. So let's see the listening. Vamos a compartir el audio ahorita. Me dicen si lo pueden escuchar. Vamos a ver. Vamos a compartir también. Number one. Lo escuchan. Onion rings. Number two. Vegetable. Number three. Bye. Onion rings. Number two. Vegetable. Number one. Number ¿Cuál, one. Era la, ¿Cuál era la Onion primera? Rings. Number two. Vegetable. Onion ring. Number three. Pasta. Number four. Chips. Number five. Ice cream. Number six. Pizza. Number seven. Lemonade. Number eight. Cola. ¿Cuál era la primera, dijo? Perdón. Rings. Rings. Sure? With um, S? No, let's Ring. Escucho. After all, te, with on. Se te oye cortado, ajá. Uh -huh. Onion rings. Ah. Rings. Anillo de cebolla or something, something like this, right? Yeah. Out of the cebolla. It's like yes. it's like the spelling. Yes, right. I guess for sure. Okay, let's see. Number two. What was the number two? Vegetables. Vegetables. Okay. Number three. Pasta. Number four. Chips. Chips. Number five. Ice cream. Ice cream. Separado por eso, lo pusieron o si no más? Separado. Separado con el guión. No, no, no. solo. Solo así. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Ice cream. Number six. Pizza. Pizza, Pizza. the most you like, right? And seven. Lemonade. Lemonade, okay. Number eight. Hola. Hola. Cola, okay, Coca Cola. Hola. Number two is vegetable. It's single, singular. It's not ah, plural. Okay. It's, it's singular. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Okay, let's check it. Ya ves si sacaron el diez. Oh, ya ven que you are pretty good in that, right? So you got 10 of 10, guys. Congratulations. Thanks. You see? Easy, right? It's about you. The things that you have to... Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, perfect. So let's do it again. Okay, did you feel difficult to practice or you feel more or less or easier? Some part were easy for me. Okay, and some others were a little difficult. Okay, perfect. So, it, especially when you have to guess, right? The part where you have to guess, that's the difficult part you, because you have to think in all the possibilities, right? You have right. to prove and prove and prove and prove, right? Okay, so let's continue. I had another one, okay? This is another one, and then we're going to continue with the manual, okay? This is easy. It's not easy. This is bien fácil, okay? Just to finish this and be clear with that topic. And then we're going to stop here. We're going to pass to the manual, okay? Esto sí es super fácil. La más difícil era la que hicieron hace rato, okay? Anteriormente. Pensé que no me quiere cargar. Vale, eso es más fácil, chicos. Ok, es easy, right? Vamos a cerrar esta y vamos a abrir la siguiente porque ustedes pueden ver que se van a encontrar acá, chicos. Let's see. Okay, so we're going to do here. Here is easier, right? 
This is like it sound, but it's easier. Complete the dialogue with would like or I like. Puede ser que está este contractado, ¿verdad? O puede ser que esté la forma larga, ¿verdad? For example, hello. What's the best, the best option? Would you like a, a pizza, right? Would you like a pizza? And so on. You are going to complete it just with would like. And then we are going to, part two, we are going to fill in with this. Fill in the blank with would like or I like. Si usted quiere ser, utilizar uno o quiere utilizar el otro, está bien. Okay, dice, would you like orange? Or I like an orange, right? Or I, it, it depends, right? This, in this case, is a question. So if you see, this is a question mark. When you don't have a question mark, that means that it's not a question. So you can use I like. This is la, la, la pista que le estoy, okay? Perfect. Go ahead.
Okay, excellent. This is more easy. It's easier, right? Okay, Charlie, thank you. Congratulations, 10 of 10. Congrats. Okay, vamos a ver. Ah, okay. It's not here, right? Okay, George, vamos a ver, George. Eight of ten. Okay, congratulations. No worry for that, George. George. It's a good grade. Don't worry for that. The most important thing you make the practice. If you want, you can do it again. No worries for that. Somebody else? JC, okay, vamos a ver, pues tengo, okay, JC, JC is 9 of 10, congratulations, and also, Araujo, so I'm just going to wait, who is Araujo? <laughs> vamos a ver, Araujo, 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 ah, okay, Jose Alexander, Araujo, okay, excelente, 8 of 10, congratulations for that, vaya, ahora vamos a hacerlo, chicos, let's, Let's see, okay, let's check it. What is the first one? Hello. Would you like, right? Hello, good afternoon. Hello, Hello. would you like a pizza? Uh, I'd one? like. No, thank you. I? I'd like. 
Ok, I like, muy bien. I, I like a fish, please, right? Let's see the other one. Would you like French fries too? Would you like a French fries too? No, thank you. I, I'd like some potatoes, please. Uh -huh. I like some potatoes, please. Here you are. Thank you. Okay, let's see part number two. This it says fill in the blank with the would you like and or I like. Remember that when we talk about questions, all questions start with would. Would, would you? Would you like orange? Or, orange. Second. Would you like some cheese? Would you like some cheese? The third one? I'd like a bread, please. I'd like a bread, please. For one? I'd uh, like a fish, uh, please. Okay. i like a fish, please. The fifth one? Would you like some fruits? Some fruits. Would you like some fruits? Excellent. Number three, put the words in order to make the sentences. Okay, what is the order, guys? Would you like some grapes? Would you like some grapes? Grapes. Would you like some grapes? Number two. I'd like some meat, please. I like some meat, please. Okay, excellent. Let's see number three. Would you like some onions? Would you like some onions? Excellent. Number four. I like an ice cream, please. I like an, an ice cream, please. Okay. Todas llevan punto, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver. No voy a hacer. Ese sí que apunto. Okay. Let's check it. Out. Diga. Esta. Salió. Okay. Salió. ¿Por qué salió mala? ¿Qué es lo que me faltó? Ah, el, el guioncito ese también. Ice cream. Este guión me faltó entonces. I like an ice cream, please. And the comma, right? Okay, right. so you're going to write the comma and also the, the, the guión, ¿verdad? No voy a ponerlo así porque si no le va a salir mala. Pero no es que esté mala, sino que solamente falta el guión en la palabra ice cream y la coma, okay? okay? So this is the result, okay? Thank you so much. Vamos a ver, who send it right now, okay? Maximiliano, excelente. Also, uh, okay, uh, just Maximiliano is sending right now. Okay, guys, so we are going to stop here with the online practice and we are going to start with the manual, okay? okay. So I need you to open your manual and page. Let me see where we were. En qué página nos quedamos? In page twenty four. Twenty four. Let me check. Okay. Yes, you're right. Okay. Let's do it. Okay, so we were here, right? The last time we were talking about pronunciation, intonation. Remember that when we have a, a yes no question, the intonation is tends to rise, right? In the 
when we talk about a WH word, the intonation tends to fall in, right? Just to remember, okay? And we were doing this, right? We we're making some questions like, do you like pop music? Do you like TV? Do you like movies? Or do you like play? You were practicing with your partner, right? Those kind of things you were doing, okay? Now, what we are going to do? We were talking about dates also, right? If I no mistake, right? Right. Hasta aquí nos quedamos in dates, right? Yes. Yes, of course. Okay, thank you so much. So let's continue with the conversation. An invitation. Who wants to read the short conversation here, please? Who wants to help me? Me, teacher. Okay, perfect. I need another volunteer, please. Hi. Okay, go ahead. I have tickets to a soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Thanks. I love to. What time does it start? At eight o'clock. That's so great. So, do you want to have dinner at six? Um, I'd like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let's just meet at the stadium before uh, the match around uh, 7 13. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That sounds fine. See you there. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Somebody else wants to practice? Me, teacher. Okay, somebody else? Roberto? Okay, Jaycee, okay, go ahead. Okay, uh, I'm Dave. I have ticket to the soccer match on Friday night. Would you like to go? Send. I love to. What time does it start? At eight. That sounds great. So, do you want to have dinner at six o'clock? Um, I would like, I like to, but I have to work late. Oh, that's okay. Let you meet at the stadium before the match around seven and thirty. Okay, let's meet at the gate. That's all fine. See you there. Okay, perfect. So let's see. What was the, the the words that you okay let, let me check uh stereo repeat a stereo stadium 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 there 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 sounds sounds some sounds some what was the other one great great great, great. Great. Right. Right. Okay, what well, what is the conversation about, guys? Try to explain it in English, please. ¿De qué se trata en la lectura? Tratemos de explicar en inglés, así un poquito. Oh. Okay, it's about a conversation between Dave and Susan. Mm -hmm. Dave is inviting Susan to go to see a, a soccer match on, mm -hmm. on Friday night. Then Susan invite him to have dinner but he says that he has to work late so he couldn't make it so it couldn't right okay perfect excellent somebody else who wants to give his or her opinion his opinion guys no it's a day teacher, they talking about a soccer match. And before the soccer match, they're going to they're gonna be on a date. So they are going to eat, uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they are going to meet in some place, right? <laughs> <laughs> in a place, Somewhere. but we don't know yet. But something <laughs> they're going to eat. <laughs> <laughs> But that's the purpose. So you already know that they are going to meet there in a, in a place, right? It doesn't matter where he is. Right? <laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you so much. 
But okay. I invite you, I motivate you guys to try to speak in English, please. Don't forget that this is a process that you have to pass that line. Please try it. No worries. Remember that this is a process and it's normal that you make mistake. And, and it's better to make mistake now and correct them that have it for a long time later, right? And then pass that line. Okay, perfect. So let's see the grammar focus. This is the things that we were discussing before. Okay, we were talking about would plus verb plus two plus the complement in this case, right? This right. is the grammar rule that we were discussing previously. So you already had it. Okay, so the, the structures of a question is would plus subject plus like plus a main verb plus what? Plus the complement plus the question mark. In the case that you are going to answer in positive form, you are going to say, yes, I would. If you are going to answer in a negative form, you can use, no, I wouldn't, okay? And here, there is no negative form here, but you already know that is that, that form that you are going to answer in the case that you have a negative answer, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Also, you can use the long form, yes, I would, or the contracted form. That is, yes, I love to. Or, yes, I really like to go. Okay? Or okay. maybe you can make a contrast. Would you like to go a soccer game? Yes, I would too, but I have to work late. Si me gustaría, pero no puedo. Es una forma diferente o disfrazada de rechazar una invitación de una forma educada, ¿verdad? Se puede decir, okay. yes, I would like, but I have to do this. Or I have to do that. Okay? Okay, so let's continue. Respond to three invitations, then write three invitations for the given response. So the first ones, you are going to say, I have a ticket to the baseball game on Saturday. Would you like to go? Usted puede decir, yes, I would like, or no, I wouldn't like. Oh, yes, o puede utilizar la forma de contraste, ¿verdad? Usted puede decir, yes, I would like, but tengo que hacer esto. Okay. Acá les están haciendo la pregunta, usted va a contestar con una de estas opciones, ¿verdad? Depende de la pregunta. Y acá les están dando la respuesta, pero usted me va a hacer la pregunta según lo que tiene la respuesta. Ok. Ok, go ahead.
let me know, guys. If you need some help, you can, can you tell me, please. And um, okay, somebody else. Somebody else? Okay, so let's start, guys. Respond the three invitations, okay? Let's see. I have a ticket to the baseball games on Saturday. Would you like to go? What's the possible answer? Yes, yes. I, I would really like, like to go. go. Yes, I would like to go. Okay, perfect. Would you like to come over for dinner tomorrow night? I like to, but I have a date with my girlfriend. Okay, perfect. Good, excellent. Uh -huh, I took it. <laughs> okay, number three. Would you like to go to a pop concert with this, with me this weekend? Yes, I like, but working this weekend. Okay, yes, I will like, but I like that I work the whole week. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. So now that we are going to write three invitations for the given response. What would be the possible questions to this answer? Yes, I love to. Thank you. Would you like to go to the beach this weekend? Would you like to go to, to the go? beach this weekend? Yes, I would love to. Okay, thank you. Mm. Yes, right? Yes, could be, right? Number five. Well, I like to, but I have to study. So this is the contrast answer. What would you be, what would be the possible question? I have an idea idea for a date. Would you like to go to the hall and dance? Okay, well, I like to, but I have to study. Okay, excellent. Good. Number six. So one guys, crick, crick, crick. Would you like to see me? 
Would you like to see a movie? Yes, thank you. I really like to see it. Okay, perfect, excellent. So pay work, ask and answer the questions in part A, giving you a response. Think of three things you would like to do, then invite a partner to do, to do them with you. Your partner asks the following questions like this, right? What is it? What is it? What time it start? Where should we meet? When does it end? Or how should we get there? Okay, quiere decir que ustedes me van a armar oraciones y ellos van a responder con estas posibles eh, preguntas, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si usted, por ejemplo, si usted le dice, eh, would you like to go to a concert? They say, yes, I would like. When, when is it? ¿Cuándo es? Ah, it's on Friday night. Ta, 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 ta. ¿Ok? ¿Me se entiende? Ok, perfecto. Entonces, vamos a hacer period ¿Ok? Voy a hacer las breakout rooms y usted me va a elaborar preguntas en las cuales se puedan, se puedan contestar con yes, I would, o no, I wouldn't, o maybe if it is possible, possible, pues, eh, positive, perdón, usted va a a hacer la siguiente pregunta, ¿verdad? ¿Cuándo es esto? ¿Dónde es esto? ¿A qué hora se empieza? Eh, ¿Dónde podríamos eh, reunirnos o encontrarnos, verdad? ¿Cuándo termina, verdad? ¿O cómo podríamos llegar ahí? ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? Clear. Ok, perfecto. Vamos a hacer las, los grupos, ¿ok? Estamos ocho, porque... Estamos nueve conmigo, entonces quiere decir que vamos a hacer cuatro nada más. Ok, perfecto. Si están solitos, los voy a cambiar. Voy a tratar de darles tiempo y luego voy a empezar a chequear. Ok. okay. Cualquier pregunta, raise your hand. Thank you. Go ahead. Thank you, Kevin. Vamos a ver. Entremos, chicos. Robert, entremos, Robert. José Alexander, also. Brian, entremos, please. Ok, guys, he compartido la fotografía donde están las preguntas que pueden surgir después de haber hecho una pregunta con would like y haberla respondido. Luego pueden hacer ese tipo de preguntas. ¿Cuándo es? ¿Dónde es? Etcétera, etcétera. Right? A modo de armar una pequeña conversación.
Ah, I confuse uh, e Elmer. I, no, no, I no. think in Elmer, Eric, Eric Mendes. No. Eric Mendes is my, my. He he works in socks. It's a coordinator. In the turno A. I think. I think. Ah, uh, he... yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yes, okay. yes, it's, it's in turn A. Yeah, yeah. I I work with with him, with but him. I I change the I change the turn. Uh, it's in finishing. Always uh, in finishing. No, um, before I work in in knitting in a warehouse the parts of machine yes yes i know it okay the after after uh, change the the position and then uh, i work and finishing okay it's okay. hard Guys, did you finish? <laughs> yes, we are finished. Tisha. Okay, but that's great. <laughs> it's great that you are practicing English. That I'm glad to do that. No matter what you are talking about, that the points yes. that you have to practice in English. That's great. Congratulations for that. Okay. Yes, Thank continue. you. Continue. Okay, continue. <laughs> you already finished. <laughs> it's okay. Continue. I'm going to check the other groups. Okay. 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 Okay, thank you. Thank you. My I my friend Eric. Uh, Okay. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello. What are you doing? Are you talking? Yes, we were talking. We already finished. But you had to talk in English, okay? No worries if you are talking. That's great. But you had to practice in English, please. <laughs> okay. I was listening to your partners and they are talking also, but they are talking in English. So that's the point. Okay, practice, <laughs> practice, practice. So you already finished, right? Right. Okay, I guess that with you, I don't have problems, right? Any problems. So that means you already finished. Let's continue talking, but in English, please. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to okay. the last group and then we're going to go out, okay? Okay. Thank you. Hello guys, how was your work? Oh, how much you good? Did you practice? Yes, teacher. You already finished? Yes. Okay. Yes. So I would like to hear you a little bit, please. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, Uy, me dejó de una carpota. No está. No, voy a poner otra vez la carpota. La... Eh. Would you like, would you like to go to the beach? Hola. Okay. Mm -hmm. Would you like to go to the beach? Uh, ah, the, the, the answer is yes, I would like. Um, 
Bueno, Vaya, sí. Ahora, José Ramón, se tiene que hacer la otra pregunta de las que están acá, miren. Ok. Ajá, ¿qué es eso? Next it? weekend. Um, ok. Ajá, ¿cuándo es? ¿Dónde es? Bueno, para el principio, ¿qué es eso? Ah, ¿qué es eso? Ah, es eso. Es un parte de la libertad. Ok, mm -hmm. ¿y What time does it does is it maybe at classes, right? What time um, does it start? At the eight 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 o'clock p.m. Uh huh. Where, Where should, should we, we meet? meet? And then we going we're going to make to the bus station. Uh huh. What does it then? And then we came we come back at. Uh, five o'clock p.m. Mm -hmm. How should we get there? Okay, by bus. <laughs> by bus, right? <laughs> no hay posibilidad. There is no posibility by car, right? Just by bus. No, humilde, humilde. Humilde, pero no en el carro rotando, rato corriendo y rato caminando. No. Es... <laughs> Yo pegué la otra frase. <laughs> Sí, es que es el carro. No, le dice, ¿cómo? En el carro donando, andando, en sexy, y rato corriendo y rato caminando. That's a job, right? Ya se quiere impar, repite, right? That's great. You, get, you, you do it great, okay? Thank you so much. Okay. Congratulations. Okay. So we are going to go out from the salas and we are going to continue in the general meeting, okay? Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, guys, we already practiced, right? We have we have two way the others can connecting go from the sagas, right? To continue this. Text and message abbreviations. Okay. A ver, I can salen los demás. So we already finished with that. We are going to wait them. Hello, how was your practice, guys? Interesting, right? Something interesting, good, excellent, right? We were entertaining, right? With the uh, conversation. Okay, so. What we are going to do now, we are going to write in a text message. This is going to be your homework, okay? Try to do it at your home. If you don't do it, please, well, we are going to make it here tomorrow, right? Because tomorrow we have classes also, right? All right. And you are going to text, text a message using these abbreviations, okay? It's like uh, you are going to make a message in clave, como dicen, right? And here um, you have the meaning of each abbreviation, okay? Try to do it, okay? You are going to write a message on uh, one to your partner, okay? A uno de sus compañeros. Is clear what you're going to do? Uh, yes, we're going to message. Uh, a uno de sus compañeros de la clase, ¿verdad? No, bueno, no importa quién, se pues va a decidir quién o quién va a trabajar. Todos están en el mismo grupo, ¿verdad? El mismo turno. Yes. Okay, so that means you can have communication. Okay, so you are going to text a message using this abbreviation. Okay, puede ser que utilice palabras completas, pero también va a utilizar abreviaciones de estas. Okay. 
Así cortito puede ser cortito, ¿verdad? No nos alarguemos tanto. Voy a utilizar algunas de esas, no las va a utilizar todas, ¿ok? Solo las que más se adapten a su, a su mensaje, ¿ok? Para mañana, ¿ok? Mañana lo vamos a leer. Please, try to do it. Because tomorrow we have the presentations of the two minutes, right? Or maybe one minute, ¿ok? And also we have this homework. Is clear? Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm going to stop here because it's time to go. We had just two minutes missing to finish the class and we are going to ask you have questions about the good life form. Any good. questions so far? Doubts, complaints? No. No, no right? Mm -hmm. I think so. Questions? Too. Question, preguntas, teacher, ¿a qué hora nos vamos a ir? <laughs> uh -huh, I know that you, that's your question, right? <laughs> Because I know for, for you, this is Monday, right? It's like a Monday. So it, it mm. tends to be a little bit low the energies, right? I understand that, okay? So, so we're going to stop here, guys, and we are going to continue tomorrow. I see you tomorrow and have a nice rest of the day, okay? Bye bye okay. and try to make the homework bye -bye. from the platform, please. Bye bye. Take care. Bye -bye. See, you. <laughs> see you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, see you. See you. Ah, last, it's finished, right? Mañana is the last day. Tomorrow is the last day, okay? Don't miss it. I can complete it all. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think you completed all, all of us. You complete all the, the homeworks. I think all yes, of us. Yes, of course. Ah, okay, perfect. Yeah, That's perfect. great. Mm -hmm. I think I don't know if if anyone out there is it's not, not complete. complete. Okay, maybe but tomorrow I, we are going to check it, right? But I help it. Mm -hmm. I help some of my of my partners. My right? partners, yes. Okay, to, perfect. Tomorrow we can, we are going to have some time to check that, and we can help them to finish that. Okay, okay bye, thank bye. you so much. Bye bye. Take care. Bye, guys. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. <laughs>